but finally got access. Hopefully that's loud enough. I'll turn it up. There we go. So the game was on sale. I think it was like twenty. It's eighteen dollars instead of like twenty-five or something. So I finally bought it. I don't know when I'll be able to get the prequel sequel. Hopefully when all of the DLC comes out and it's affordable. Anyway, uh, I managed to stay completely blind to. The entirety of this game, unlike Wolf Among Us and Walking Dead, so that's why I'm going to record this. Game of depth choices, that's like a telltale thing. I mean, that makes sense, that's like the company name. Back again to hear another story of immense fortune and unthinkable peril. Well, I have some time. The borderlands of Pandora were told to contain mysterious alien treasure troves filled with advanced technology and incredible power. Vaults, the people called them. And to seek one out was to earn you the title a Vault Hunter. At least by me. You could say Handsome Jack was one such explorer, though his methods could be seen as uh, somewhat unsporting. I'm disappointed Craig and Gage weren't there. He ran the Corporation Hyperia and died trying to claim Pandora as his own. History's attention is fickle, my friends. It will remember those pirates like Handsome Jack, but forget the adventurers who risk it all for less uh, obvious rewards. Stories, legends, those are much better at getting at the real spirit of things. Stories remember both sides of the tale. Alright, so Marcus just gave us a little introduction. There's a skeleton on a pike there. The cat is feeling me up. Cat, stop it! It's really rude. It's a rack. The sound, anyway, that's a skag skeleton. Uh. Ah, here's our male protagonist. Fortune is on rails. Our future is on rails. Fiona! Oh. Come on! We can work this out! Your stupid little boots. Fiona? What, is there some sort of radiation leak? I don't know. That is not Fiona. Company man. Hmm. They're gonna eat him. Where exactly are we going? I ask the questions. Okay, then uh, do you mind asking yourself where you're taking me? <laughs> oh! <laughs> Ow, what the hell? Tell me about the Gordas Project. <laughs> Is that what this is about? <laughs> Look, Gordas is bad business. If you want a real hot investment, I am on the ground floor of some property on E. Okay, 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 okay. Don't be a smartass. I'm not a patient person. So just start talking. Just where do you start when you're getting dragged through the desert and, uh... From the beginning. Right. 
That hook had some flipping issues there. Mm. I guess it all started with a promotion. See, I'd spent my entire career up at Hyperion, so I suppose that makes me one of the bad guys in this story. Sort of. Handsome Jack, he was the you baddest guy of them all. This long. It must feel good I to find to be it, just you know? like him. Take it. It's that yours. That is not a good right? career goal. <laughs> I mean, you always said that. <laughs> Everyone did. I gotta be honest, I always thought it was sort of cheesy, but, uh, but hey, here Which we are. Which resulted in a company overflowing with assholes. A new dog fight. Animals. A monkey fight. When I Handsome guess. Jack died, it somehow got even worse. It took some time to fit in. But a few stabs and select backs, a new haircut, and the help of a couple friends, I was on my way to get the promotion that was going to change my life. Scratch that. Our lives. For the best. I was a little distracted. It was a big day for us. Luckily, Vaughn was concentrating on the important things. What's the first thing you're going to buy? I know what Anderson's making. I do his payroll. Your best friend, the money man. If you're getting a fraction of what he earns, you'll be rolling in it. Being an exec in Hyperion comes with expectations. Yeah, I figure I could get lunch. Seems like a good place to start. Well, then we're starting with three of whatever's most expensive. Sure. And wine pairings. For lunch? We're gonna get twisted, bro. If I'm not puking up $500 in food and alcohol this afternoon, then we are doing it wrong. I'm reading out of bed afterwards to celebrate. She booked us a table. Yep. Sounds good. Look, we had to do a lot of awful stuff to get you to this point. Do I regret some of it? Sure I do. Every night it haunts my dreams, but that doesn't matter now. Because you made it. You deserve this, man. And don't ever think you don't. And don't ever think about the Iridium Mine deal we put together. Thanks for the help, Vaughn. Really. I couldn't have done this without you and Yvette. Hey, man, don't sweat it. Uh, I'm just happy we even no, got you, you here. Won't forget this. You know, I crunched the numbers one night and figured out there was a 45% chance someone would kill you before this day. Glad that didn't happen. Me too. It was a uh, real touch and go there for a bit. All right, man. Let's get that Hyperion face on. <laughs> oh, right, yeah. Uh. Hmm. Oh, we need some condescending. It's a little too friendly right now. Okay, tell you what. Tilt your head back. Uh, like if you ask me if there's anything up your nose. How's that? There you go. You don't respect me at all. Perfect. And there goes Mr. the facade. Henderson? Have a seat, Reese. I'll just be a second. No, I wasn't talking to you. Is that Brock Sampson? Yes, I'm talking to you now. Yeah, but I don't want it in red. I want it in black. Yes, it is. Because black is better. Look, don't <laughs> concern yourself with why, okay, Jerry? Concern yourself with how. And just send the car over when it's ready. Company car. Didn't even have to ask. Your Hyperion nemesis. You look surprised to see me, Reese. And if I'm reading the situation right, and I usually am. You're not too happy about it either. This all came together quick. So, you might not have been in the loop. Uh, Henderson promised me a promotion. I see. Well, Henderson is out, so... You're going to be reporting to me now, please. And I want you to know the promotion that you worked so hard to get. That's still coming. Well, that's a relief. <laughs> Cause I... But this is about more than that, Reese. It's about your future in this company. Look, you want to know the reason why I'm in that chair and you're not? For the exact same reason why North is North. Why the handsome guy always gets the girl. And why every spaceship in the universe is shaped like a gun. <laughs> it's destiny, Reese. And men, real men, men like me make their own. And you can hold a grudge if you like. No harm, no foul. Your thoughts are your own. But bad things can happen when you swim against fame. 
Sometimes men find themselves standing in the way of other men's destiny. You don't want to be that man. Oh. Wow. I could not have timed that better. That really helps dramatically make my point. <laughs> Which is this. This promotion is going to take you out of the way of other people's destiny and put you on your own path. And that, my friend, is why I am promoting you to... Jerry, why isn't my new car digestructing in my office yet? That's because it's August. Oh, August. Uh, yeah, cool, listen. Uh, I actually have somebody here with me, so... Uh... Are you buying this bulb key or what? Because I... How did this happen so quick? I thought I'd have more time. Of course, I'm still interested. I... Yes, I'm near a computer. Ten million. Yeah. It's just that's a lot of money to get together on short notice. Murder a bunch of bandits. I mean, I'm not trying to be obstinate, but I need time. Also, uh, just a quick thing. Murder is how Jack got his position in Hyperion. Ugh. Just... Why do the biggest scumbags yeah. always have yeah, the best view? Yeah, yeah, no, but... Three years sucking up to the guy. Do you the want the window. money or not? Because I... It's not. No, it won't be a big deal for me to get... Yes, that should be me. Only less... Vasquez -y. Yeah, that's what we had before. It's a working day, August. And I just got this promotion. <laughs> kind of sprinkles. <laughs> Not well. <laughs> what a waste. Yeah, uh, it was such look, a look, nice look. suit. Why are you turning this into a whole thing right now? Ain't no thang. <laughs> Not yet. Nice try. Uh... Look, I'll have to call you back. I... One natural moon. Pandora's potential for profit is rivaled only by its potential to kill you within minutes of setting uh -huh. foot on its surface. Holographic computer yeah. monitor. Expensive. No, Last high. Hugo Bassett. Currently viewing one encrypted file. Do you want the money or not? Why are you trying to screw me on this? Oh, fine. Just wait there, okay? I can only be down at... If it's gonna be ten million dollars, I'm gonna need another hour or two. Okay. Yeah, I'll be there in a bit. Well, then just stay there. It's a tourist shop, right? Buy a mug or something. Sure. 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 Okay. Say hi to your mom. Damn it! Ah, right. Now, what were we talking about? Before we were so rudely interrupted. We were talking... <clears throat> we were talking about my promotion. All right, your uh, promotion. Henderson was a fool. He didn't know his place. He needed lesson number one. Humility. But you... I respect you, Reese. That's why I'm gonna make you assistant vice janitor. What? No. No, you, you, you can't. I'm the boss now, Reese. I do whatever I want. Report to Sewage Scout 23. Effective immediately. You better get an eye installed in the back of your head. Because you never know when... I could be uh, behind you. You little shit. I'm your boss, Reese. Get used to that. 
This is what You're I'm in talking a gun about company. when I say humility. They're shitty guns, but they're guns. That was lesson number two. Don't make lesson number three about a number two. What? Don't make me crap on the floor and make you clean <laughs> it up. You're dismissed, Reese. I'll let you know when I need my trash can emptied. Yeah, Iberian guns suck. They can only aim when you rapid fire. What the hell fire. was that? He can't do this to us! He just did. No. No, no, this can't be happening. And they make sniper They're rifles. They're finished. You know who this place is. There's blood in the water! And everyone can smell it! No, no, no they can't. Not yet, unless you don't quiet down. We just gotta keep it on the down low until we figure something out. It's not that bad yet. Oh. Senior Vice Janitor Reese to Sector D451 for trash cleanup. Because that is your job now, to clean up trash with your bare hands. Sorry, you were saying something? I interrupted you. Reese, why are you cleaning up trash? I thought you were getting a promotion. Trash duty seems like the opposite of a promotion. Henderson's dead. What? Are you sure? Yeah. I mean, you can ask him yourself. He's floating outside in space! It's that prick Vasquez. <sighs> he threw Henderson out of an airlock and demoted Reese to trash man. Holy crap! So, does that mean you're not buying? Oh, the best friend. Sitting and lunch leech. <laughs> well, just try and lighten the mood. And I didn't bring my wallet, so if someone pays for me... I'll tell you who's gonna pay. Vasquez. I don't know if he's the type of... We can't let that prick get away with this. We need to do something. He just killed a guy. Maybe it's better we lay low for a bit. What? No way. We hit back. We steal his deal. We steal his deal. Yes! That is what I'm talking about. What are you talking about? Vasquez set up a deal on Pandora for a vault key. Whoa. That must be why he got the promotion. The only thing Hyperion cares about more than money is, is vault keys. It's perfect! I mean, not only do we screw over Asquez, we have a friggin' vault key! What are they worth? Like a billion dollars? More. Yeah, but we need ten million dollars right now to make the deal. Hold, please. Done. <laughs> I'm not gonna lie. That was impressive. I'm in accounting. I mean, it's what I do. Ten million bucks is chump change around here. By the time anyone notices, we'll have a vault key. Hell, it's chump change cool. on Pandora once well, you killed enough. Looks like you boys Mobs. got it all figured out. I'm gonna go eat. Alone? Call me if you don't get killed. Whoa, whoa, right? whoa, hey, hey, we need your help. We need clearance, transportation. You're a requisitions master. We need that stuff. Yeah, maybe a loader bot or two, you know, things get dicey. Look, it's one thing stealing from a bunch of poor suckers on Pandora. You're talking about stealing from Hyperion. But we're friends! Friends help each other steal stuff. I mean, that's how it works. Richter used to steal candy bars. His family still doesn't know where the body is. Come on, I'll buy you the lunch I owe you when we get back. Fine. But you're buying me lunch now, and when you get back. <laughs> Done. We only got a couple hours. Go withdraw the cash. I'll get you guys clearance to Pandora, get you geared up, and issue you a standard Hyperion town car. What? Standard? Really? You can't spring for premium? Seat warmers, maybe Why do you a need warmers? or something? It's a desert sure. planet. Yeah, a convertible. So, just so I got this straight, you want me to get you a car to drive around Pandora that leaves you less protected? Right? Look, it just... You're gonna steal something, I figure... No. No, don't worry. I've got a car in mind. Skier? Catch a ride. What is that? Oh, it's one of the... Zephyrs?
He must be waiting out for Scooter. Oh, and now he's just dug something up. He's going to be turned into a pancake. Is up? Oh, nope. Bandit. Using a high is that a high team? No. Or the Jacobs. Maybe. <laughs> they stole his car. I love that. I love that a lot. That's good. That is quality. That is maybe. <laughs> there goes the rat. So nervous. Psycho. Yeah, shit starts quiet now. I'm not gonna be talking like as you saw. I'm not gonna be talking a whole lot. Just mainly when there's pauses. What do we even? Oh, what do we even Bobby? hit? Wow! Oh, I hope that wasn't like a really ugly person. What you cross right there? <laughs> That's a skag, oh, dude. Crap. I think we. I think we killed it. Don't we're investigate it. We're, we're murderers. We're murderers. Great, great. We murder. Relax, Vaughn. It's a skag. They breed like hostile rabbits down here. Still, it's kind of sad. Yeah. Kind of. Okay, I'm gonna call it that one here. See you in the next one.